Welcome to Career Expert Show. I am your host, Anastasia Oninye Chukoka Orebunem. In this show, I will be presenting professionals in different fields. They will be teaching us or telling us their experience in their field. So I'll be interviewing them. Well, my name is Rachel G. Onyemairo. I am the founder of Innovative Mind Vision Africa, a physical community where industry experts and I share expert knowledge, skills, experiences, and business ideas that help our members to build brands that stand out globally. We are also the director of Innovators Art Space, a highly innovative business institution where I help visionary entrepreneurs to build globally relevant brands using the personality space kit and highly innovative business ideas. I'm an author of the Bicentical Wildly and the host of the live show called Agreement to Structure where we have kids to develop innovativeness so as to solve society problems and develop public speaking skills that meet global standards. The best part of my job, well, as Confucius once said, he said, find a job you love doing and you don't have to work any day in your life. So what I do, the best part of it is that I don't think, I don't even feel like I'm doing a job because it's something I love doing. Besides, it, it's something that makes me help people do what they are created to do, do what they love doing, solve problems, making money, and of course, go global doing all of that. So for me, I feel fulfilled doing the job in this way. I work on many things. One, I help individuals is called exactly how their lives with business. I help them to build businesses around the confines of that purpose. And so I'll innovate their way so to us to stand out, you know, in a highly competitive market and of course globally. I do this using my Facebook community, Innovative Minds in Africa, using my online institution, the Idea um, Innovators Eyes Space, using um, Idea Moment to Treasure, which is my last show, and my book, which is a very relevant tool, why they in the next few years, I hope to build my Facebook community to become one of the largest Facebook communities across the globe committed to capacity building. Two, so I want to collaborate and of course work with mega international institutions and platforms like Forbes, United Nations, World Economic Forum, and so on. Three, rather, I want to um, collaborate with other international agencies to make international opportunities more accessible for innovators and intending innovators across the African continent. Looking at the changes I want to make, I want to automate a number of things. Like yes, much more than I've ever done. Two, I want to extend my operations to the kids. Yes, I've reached thousands of adults. This time I want to reach thousands of youths, um, children rather, people between 12 and 4 years. Three, I want to translate a lot of my resources and tools into different languages of the world other than just the English language. So these are the major changes I want to make in my job. The pandemic uh, prevented us from holding physical events. That was the biggest challenge I had with it. But then it pushed me to innovate other ways. So today we have what we call innovating through videos, which we do in my Facebook community, which helps people to share the innovations orally. Of course, also I innovated um, Idea Moment with Treasure, which is a live show. So it actually prevented us from hosting a um, physical event, but today I do that virtually and instead of having like 10,000 or less, I now have about 15,000 people or more in virtual settings. So we are good. Well, I help people develop innovativeness. I don't just help you advance the one you have. If you are not innovative, I can teach you how to become one. Two, I help individuals to deal businesses that align with their purposes not just any business and that's one of the reasons i stand out in the crowd my tools and my resources are very practical they show you not just why not just what but how to do it that's why my book why they do remains a bestseller to date like i already do i don't just run businesses i solve problems professionally therefore i want my admirers to learn how to search for problems how to spot problems and how to solve problems and how to do that sincerely innovatively and of course excellently maybe you should have asked me how i was able to build such a fast-growing global brand within the shortest period of time well it's because of my business values i have values that are based on first integrity Honesty is a watchword in my business, so my clients can attest to that. Two is innovativeness. It has to either be new or an old one, but administered in somewhat new way. Three, it has to be excellent. I mean, if it's not exceptional, I do not deliver it. And that's why recently I was recognized in the United States as one of the women 
that forced their way to global relevance and success despite challenges. You can reach me on Facebook, I was Rachel G. Onyemairo. You can um, follow me, I have a Facebook page called Rachel G. Onyemairo. You can also follow me on my timeline. You can join my Facebook community, the Innovative Mind Nation Africa is on Facebook. On Instagram, I am at Rachel underscore, Gine Katuku underscore Onyemairo. I'm also on LinkedIn as Gine, Rachel G. Onyemairo. On YouTube, you can search me as Rachel G. Onyemairo TV. So across the social media platforms, I am Rachel G. Onyemairo. Please follow my page because that's where it's happening.